They call it CoQ10. CoQ10 is good for your heart. Um, I guess this is, it's not a vitamin. It's, it's not an herb. I'm, I don't know if it's an amino acid. I'm really not sure what it is actually. Let's, let's Google it so that we know exactly what it is. But it is a, a thing <laughs> that comes in a pill and it's good for your heart. And I've heard about this years ago from Dr. McCullough, who takes this as part of his uh, regimen, probably not specifically this Whole Foods brand. This is just the one that I recently picked up at the store. But I, I'm glad that I checked it out because I definitely do feel a difference. If you're experiencing any kind of heart palpitations or any just kind of like weird feelings in your heart, you probably should check this out. It's um, It just kind of like calms everything down. I am at the time of this uh, video, 38 years old. So uh, I think that, you know, when I go to the gym, I'm in relatively good shape. But it's just a little something extra to, to help you be more healthy. You know, why not? So, you know, you're taking your multivitamin. It probably does not contain this CoQ10. Um, so I buy it and this actually comes in the 60, 60 milligram tablets uh, dosage. And I went on to Google because I took one and I didn't really actually, okay, so a little bit story, backstory about this. I bought a multivitamin that was, I mean, <laughs> chewable, which is pretty weird to buy a chewable uh, vitamin as an adult, but, uh, and it was gummy too. But it turns out like uh, there's actually a lot of companies that are making, um, I like her by the way, uh, a lot of gummies uh, for multivitamins that companies are manufacturing this gummy form. And I'm not really sure why. Unfortunately, it was so sweet. It was so sweet. I actually had to take it back. But it did contain the CoQ10 in this particular multivitamin. I can't remember what it was called. But I enjoyed the fe the effects of the CoQ10, and I, I didn't. I sh should probably go back and check out what dosage it was at because um, 60, if you take just this capsule, is not giving me the same feeling and effect that I had from the multi. So um, I actually take four of these tablets a day now. So um, What's that? 240, 240 milligrams of CoQ10 a day. And it feels pretty good. Um, as I was starting to say before, I, you know, I went on to Google and I did some research about what people were, you know, recommending in terms of dosages. And I think that 240 is still very safe. People were reporting to take much higher uh, amounts of CoQ10 during the, you know, a day. So, I feel good. Uh, my heart feels calm with 240. So um, yeah, that's that's my recommendation. Or I'm not recommending it. I'm just telling you what I'm doing. I mean, this is what it is. So um, I, I guess you know I love Whole Foods. Whole Foods is a pretty good brand. Um, haven't really tried any others, just separate. But I would buy this again. Uh, of course, I like to see what else is out there as well so maybe i'm gonna buy a different brand just to kind of like a b them but you know if there was no other option and i was just in the store and this was the only thing that was available i would yeah i would pick this up again it, it makes you feel good i'm trying to think of how to describe the feeling it's kind of like if you had pressure on your heart if you take this the pressure goes away so <laughs> <laughs> and that it's probably not good to say that like that's not um it's like if you feel pressure on your heart and you go to the gym the pressure goes away well this kind of happens chemically um if you're eating a lot of and i actually recently changed my diet i'm mostly vegan at this point so yeah just you know trying to stack all these good healthy habits together going to the gym uh eating uh you know, not a lot of uh, meat products, saturated fats, staying away from all that stuff, uh, eating a diet that's clean and considered good for the vascular system. And this is kind of the icing on the cake, um, you know, that will kind of make everything just 
balance out and be right. I, I don't think that if you eat, uh, if you don't go to the gym and if you eat cheeseburgers all day, this, um, I mean, it still kind of might help, but it's not gonna work as good as if you're doing everything together. So yeah, I'm a fan. Uh, if you're curious, check it out yourself. There's a link in the description. And that's my two cents about CoQ10.